And good evening, hockey fans in Newfoundland and Labrador, across Canada and around the world via the internet. We welcome you to game number three of the 2024 Herder Memorial Championship Series between the Deer Lake Red Wings and the St. John's Senior Caps. Tonight we are at the Hodder Memorial Recreation Complex in Deer Lake. Caps lead this series two games to none after two games in St. John's, or actually in CBS last weekend, winning by scores of 3-2 and 7-4. Quickly come up inside of our broadcast booth for just a moment. Hi everyone, George Scott here with you again for uh, tonight's game. We've got a couple of lineup changes, not much really uh, happening between the two teams in terms of lineup changes, but a few minor ones for uh, the St. John's Roof Tech senior caps. Uh, Dylan McKenzie is out tonight. Uh, Mike Druken will be playing uh, for the caps uh, tonight. He did not play last weekend in CBS. And uh, changing backup goaltenders last weekend, Devin Parsons was in. It's Andrew Curtis will be back up tonight, of course. Uh, Kyle Downer will be the starter for St. John's. For Deer Lake, Roger Snow is serving a one-game suspension the, that he picked up in game number two last weekend, so he is out of the lineup tonight. He'll be back in tomorrow. Uh, so Mike Brent, pick up from the Grand Falls Winter Cataracts, will uh, be playing on defense tonight for the Red Wings. And also the other change they've got is uh, Ryan Penny will not be playing tonight for, uh, for Deer Lake. Uh, he is coaching this week in all kinds of minor hockey tournaments happening, and he has committed to coaching, so he is out of the lineup. And that really is it. That's the only changes that there are for the, uh, the teams this evening. We've got our good friend Mike Golding, who does the Facebook Live for the Deer Lake Red Wings, working the camera for us this evening. And we've got a full house here in Deer Lake, as we had last year for the first two games of the Herders. The Red Wings took on the Southern Shore Breakers last year. A big crowd on hand, as I said, sold out. It was sold out last weekend in CBS. A lot of interest in this series. Red Wings, of course, down two to nothing. And there's their mascot. <laughs> Interacting with the kids. Can we get some pictures taken? I am saying the Red Wings down two. You know, they used this before. The cliche is that the series doesn't start till the home team loses. But down two to nothing, you've got to think it's a must win for the Red Wings tonight to get back into this one. They don't want to go down three to nothing because we all know when you fall behind three to nothing, it is very rare to come back. Just waiting for the teams to come out on the ice. Crowd still filing in to the Hodder Memorial. Maybe you weren't with us last week, just a reminder that uh, Deer Lake were able to pick up four skaters and goaltender. They dressed three in any given game. So tonight they've got three of their skaters dressed. Uh, Cody Drover, actually they've got four. Cody Drover, Jordan Marr, and Mitchell Normore, along with Mike Brent. And the officials coming out onto the ice. And they've got the red carpet out on the other side, so it looks like we're going to have some pregame festivities or ceremonies before the opening puck drop. If you're not familiar with the Hodder, both teams will enter from the far end of the ice. Both dressing rooms down under the bleachers down the far end, side by side.
A little bit of a different setup here at the Hodder than in some other stadiums. No seating on the far side of the ice, as you can see. Just the, uh, the two benches. And the gate is open down there. Here come the St. John's Caps, led by goaltender Kyle Downer. We'll be defending the net down to our right. Backup goaltender Andrew Curtis. Got the job of carrying the clipboard apparently. There's Kyle Downer. the hometown Red Wings. First two games were played last week in CBS, as we mentioned. Here come the Red Wings to a rousing ovation from the home crowd. Games three, four, and five, if necessary, will be here in Deer Lake this weekend. Game four tomorrow night, 7.30, same time. If the Red Wings can win either tonight or tomorrow, we'll play a game five on Sunday afternoon, 1.30 game time. Young Deer Lake fans down below us. <laughs> Should be a good one tonight, folks. And a couple of good games last weekend. Game number one. St. John's got it to a three to nothing lead partway through the third period. And Deer Lake stormed back at a couple of goals, had a chance with the net empty to tie it up. St. John's hung on to win it. 3-2, second game, 7-4. St. John's gave up a couple of goals early and never could quite catch up. Across the way, we've got Joe Maynard and Gary Gale from Hockey Newfoundland and Labrador. And Joe's got a trophy in his hands. And we'll see what that's about. played in game one last week, had a sensational game. Red Wings decided to go with Josh Loach, pick up from Stephenville in game two. Premier. Premier. 
Steve Sherry. Getting a mixed reaction from the crowd here in Deer Lake. <laughs> Deer Lake Red Wings, but as they mentioned, played all this season with the Grand Falls Winter Cataracts going to pick up players. Sportsman like player. Finished second in scoring in the Central West League this year, just one point behind teammate Jordan Marr. Stephen Sims, Mike Druken, the two captains. To the ceremonial opening face-off presided over by the Premier of the province, Premier Fury. And it looks like he's cheering for Deer Lake. I believe he's got on a Red Wings cap over there. Time now for the National Anthem. All right, we are set to get underway. Game number three, the 2024 Herder Memorial Championship Series. Deer Lake Red Wings, St. John's Roof Tech Caps. St. John's lead the series two to nothing. George Scott here along with cameraman Mike Golding. Again, starting goaltenders for St. John's, Kyle Downer. For Deer Lake, Billy Clark. Yeah. 
All right, right from the opening face-off. Puck is held by Downer. Face-off right down below us. In behind the St. John's net. A little bump back there. Murphy Johnson, long pass up ahead. First save made by Clark. Rebound was there. Clark had to make a second one. As Thompson had the chance coming down the right wing. Up down in the corner. St. John's with a can't clear it. It goes to the fire boards. Kept in by the Caps. Long shot went off the leg, comes through the near boards. Jumping on it quickly, Murphy Johnson. Weak shot in on goal. Clark directs it up and into the mesh. Face off. We'll be in the Deer Lake end. Oop, linesman took a little tumble. Oh, and another one. <laughs> Not a good start. Face off to Clark's right, one by St. John's. Parfrey tried to feed it in front, that's cleared out. Norman, he'll get the center, backhanded it in, just got over the red line before he cleared it in. Clark out to play, it throws it up around the boards. Red Wings tried to bring it out, they turn it over inside their own blue line, then they'll get it out. Langdon's got it off the boards. Langdon goes down at center. Norman's got it, Norman bringing it in over the blue line on the left side, a shot. Goes off the end boards, comes to the side of the goal. It hit the post. Sticks went in the air. The referee waved it off. That would have been a tough one to give up early. Bishop. He shot scores. Joel Bishop. Quickly. One to nothing. Caps come up with it down along the boards. Bishop just holds a little delay right there. Nice move, pulls it back, give himself some room. Beats Clark. High glove side. One to nothing for the Caps early. The goal comes a minute, 31 seconds into the opening period. I tell you, Joel Bishop is so impressive. Had a couple of great games last weekend out in CBS. And just that little delay move to get himself free. Red Wing player went down to try and block the shot and just held it. Great patience. Now the home side, down one to nothing. Take the crowd out of it because this crowd was fired up before the game. They need to get something going to get the crowd back again. Red Wings have it. This is Drover. Drover, Marr, and Morgan are out there. Or Mitchell rather, right in front of a chance for him. Drover went just wide, back of the point, kept in, wrist shot, that's blocked. Meyer has it, Jordan Meyer in front for Drover, pucks in the crease, still loose. Off the glass, it'll go out of play. And great response by the Red Wings, almost tied up. Parfrey McGraw picking up the assists on the Bishop goal. Great chance for Cody Drover a moment ago, put it just wide. Now we got the two Hines brothers out there, Michael and Brandon. <laughs> Along with Anderson, and Anderson puts a big hit in. Big pile up down in the corner. Four players went down, two from each team. Out in front, Brandon Hines, that hit the outside of the net. Hines back at the point, thrown in front, it's tipped. Downer kept that out. Terrific response by the Red Wings. Murphy Johnson. MJ will settle it down behind the goal. Now he'll bring it out. 
Swings wide, smooth skating defenseman down the left side, gets it down in deep, drives it all the way behind the goal. Tried to play it back to the point. He still got it, then he's pushed to the boards and knocked down. Murphy Johnson slow to get up down in the corner. He is struggling to get back to the bench. He was hit hard, he's still not back to the bench. Finally gets there. Park. Up there with Thomas. Thomas avoids a hit, puck bounces right out in front. Park with a backhand, didn't get through. Park's got it again, plays it behind the goal. Thomas, he's got Langdon out in front. Langdon's got it, threw it in front. Thomas couldn't get to it. McKim off the glass and out for St. John's. Well, after that first goal by St. John's, it's been all Deer Lake for the last couple of minutes. Two big shifts. Still can't beat Downer though, that's dumped in. Drover, Drover gave it away. Roberts with a shot, that just went wide. I'm oh, sorry, right out. Drover's got it, Cody Drover in over the blue line. Meyer heading for the front of the goal, pass went off a skate, cleared to the boards. Meyer got a stick on it first, Parfrey's got it for St. John's. Patrick Parfrey. That'll be offside, faceoff will come outside the blue line. 15.30 to go, first period, one to nothing, St. John's. Yeah, the, the initial rule was that Deer Lake could pick up four skaters, but only dress three, but with the suspension to Snow, they were allowed to dress four of those pickup players tonight. Long shot in, Clark's got it and will hold on. So it's Drover, Mar from the Cataracts along with Mike Brent from the Cataracts. And Mitchell Alexander Normor from the Stephenville Lightning. Pender steps into it, got, got right on goal and Clark had to make the save. Good hard shot by Roger Pender. Backhanded in by Langdon. Langdon's got it along the boards down the far corner. Right across from us. Langdon having a look out in front, puck bounces around. There's a high stick, it's gonna be a penalty to St. John's. Urquhart was clipped. And Roger Pender was knocked down after the play. The Caps are complaining that maybe it should have been a penalty on that as well. Checking, two minutes, high sticking. So first power play of the game. Belongs to the Red Wings. Comes back to the point, Sims. Knight has got the penalty for St. John's. Shot scores! Brandon Hines. No, actually, it's 92, not 91. Mitchell Normore responds. That did not take long. They tie it on the power play. This is Sims. Down to Normor in the circle. He'll just turn, stop. Nothing complicated about that. Some traffic in front. Beats downer. We're tied at one. Get our scoreboard straightened out. One one is the score. 14.38 to go. Here in the first period. Now the faceoff down in the Deer Lake end. Kim headed in his skates. The 
is Mike French playing it off the boards. Kept in. McKim turns, shoots that one off the skate, hit the glass. Stayed in play. That shot scores! Goals coming fast and furious. Kyle McGraw puts St. John's back in front. And they win the battle along the boards. There's Murphy Johnson who was shaken up earlier back out there into the middle. Using the defenseman as a screen beats Clark. And it is two to one as we're back live. Humber dredge hit hard along the boards by Normore. Lifted in, wide of the goal. On it first, Normore trying to center it. Drover reaching for it. Drover's got it. Marr had his stick all tied up, couldn't get a shot away. Humber dredge. Flipped it ahead. He was looking for Stevens. Puck goes down into the corner. Red Wings couldn't get it out. Turn it over right at the blue line. Chance at the side of the goal for Thompson. Now it's Murr. Murr shoots it in wide. Murr gets the return pass from Anderson. McKay, his shot was blocked. Comes back to Lucas McKay. That was blocked by Bishop. Bishop racing after it. Clark wasn't quite sure what he was going to do. He ended up coming out and playing it. Got it to the boards. Bishop in front for McGraw, comes to the side net. McKim couldn't get a stick on it. McKay gets out past McKim, puck goes up in the air. Roger Pender tipped in by McKim, back to get it is McKay. Goes the other side. Anderson got back there. They can't get it out though, turn it over. Here's Bishop, dangerous. Right out with a chance, that did not get through to goal. All the way down the ice, and this will be icing against the Red Wings. 12-14 to go. Period number one, three goals already. Walsh, he shot one off the stick of Urquhart. Urquhart's got it now. Good pass. We move it ahead. There's Parsons in looking forward out there with Langdon. Caps come up with it. Walsh leaves it behind the goal. Murphy Johnson. Langdon watching him. Pass too far for right out, but Drugan's got it, then he left it for fewer. He couldn't handle it. The Red Wings have it. Sims. Pass a little bit too far, but that's gonna go right on goal, so no icing. In fact, the faceoff now will be in the St. John's end. Both teams to make some changes. The Drover Marr, no more line out there again. Norman. Knocked down by Drover to Marr. Marr in. Drops it off. No more with a shot that rattled around. Downer is down and shaken up to St. John's goaltender. Pass went from Drover to Marr to Normor. Put the puck into the crease and there was a collision in the crease. Downer 
still on the ice, attended to by the trainer. Hopefully he'll be okay to continue. It looks to be okay, gets back up. Kyle Downer appears to be staying in. Grabs his stick. We grab a little drink of water. We're good to go. Cole wins the faceoff down into the corner to Norman. Knight off the boards and out. Oh, it hit the banner. I think it was the Darren Langdon banner. Across the ice there. Number 24. So play stopped and comes back into the St. John's end. Faceoff win for the Red Wings. Robinson tried to put it towards goal. Too many bodies there, didn't get through. That puck bounces around outside. Red Wings have it. Marr. Dumps it in. Marion Hart on the four check. Norman gets it to the boards. St. John's forced to just dump it out. Long shot in and Downer has that in the trapper it holds on. And we get a little bit of how do you do in behind the net. Marin Parfrey. Norman in there as well. The officials get in between the players and nothing comes of that. Hines into the middle. Michael Hines avoided the hit. Gets the puck in the corner, gets it into the front of the goal, reaching out for it is downer. That puck was still loose, cleared down the ice by the Caps, and that'll be icing. Again, both teams change with 10.05 left to go in the first period. Red Wings won the faceoff, but it went between the two defensemen. Sims put it over to Brent. There's McGraw for St. John's. Knocked down by McKim, and he gave it away to Park. Drops it back to Brent. And Brent gets rid of it. Roger Pender backing up in his own end. Gets the return pass. Head to Bishop. Bishop bringing it in. Bishop stops inside the blue line turn. Shoots it off the boards. Park just gets rid of it. Pender's got it at center. Heffernan. Just gets it in and the puck comes right back to Heffernan. Inside the blue line. Not a whole lot happening right now after a... Very active opening 10 minutes. Pace is slow just a little bit right now. Knight has it for St. John. Shot from a sharp angle is stopped by Clark. Knight's got it again in front. Couldn't control the bouncing puck and it goes into the corner. Knight in behind the goal. Back out in front. Behind the goal. McGurk, he's pushed against the boards. Puck comes loose. Red Wings have it. Drover. Marr. Marr. A little button hook. Stops. Goes the other side. That's picked off. Back comes Brandon Knight. Knight in over the blue line. Knocked off his stick. It goes into the corner. 
And the Red Wings will bring it out. Grover to Marr. Marr, shot! Save made by Downer. Cleared to the boards. Druken off the boards and out. Hit the linesman. Stopped right there. Oak has it for Deer Lake. It fell into the bench as the gate was open. Shot in by Fewer. Right out in there looking for it. Right out working it up along the boards. Leaves it back into the corner for right out. Went right through the crease. Came out towards the blue line. Racing onto it. Parsons. Parsons has got it for the Red Wings. Just inside the blue line. Comes his side. Robinson with a shot. That hit Downer up high. Downer is shaking up again. That hit him up in the neck area. Play continues. Langdon in behind the goal. Back. Penalty coming up to St. John's. Goaltenders got out in favor of the extra attacker. St. John's touch it up. And it will be another power play for Deer Lake. I think it's going to be Norman heading to the penalty box. Deer Lake. Back on the power play. They scored after just a few seconds on their first power play attempt. And we seem to have lost our camera, folks. Not quite sure why. Let's see if we can get this going. Hmm. All right. We are back. That was odd. All right. Red Wings on the power play, and Caps come up with it. Clear it down the ice. Minute 12 to go in the power play. Big hit inside the blue line. Murphy Johnson hit Drover, and the puck is cleared out. Marr winding up. Marr in over the blue line, drops it back. Robinson played it to the other point. Nobody there. Right out is knocked down. 30 seconds to go in the power play. Marr. Marr brings it in, surrounded by three caps. Marr somehow comes up with the puck down in the corner. Works it up along the boards. Jordan Marr getting it out in front on his backhand. Couldn't shoot it. Gets it to Drover. Drover has his pocket picked by McGraw and sent down the ice. Just 10 seconds to go now in the power play. And that's going to do it. Penalty is now over. Just over five minutes left in the first period. That was tipped, so no icing. Oak plays it to his defense partner. McKay gets it out. Backhanded in by Thomas. And behind the goal, Murphy Johnson looking for it. Anderson in forechecking came up with it back at the point. McKay, his shot off a stick, was over the top of the goal. Parsons couldn't get another big hit over along the boards. It's been a physical game. Norman, he's hit by Anderson, but gets it out. Humber Dredge, holding it, gets in, shoots, scores! Tanner Humber Dredge made the move, made the pass. And it's put home, and it is three to one. Murphy Johnson made the play in his own end, took that hit to get the puck up ahead to Dredge. Humber Dredge gets it across, and I believe that's McKim. It is number 11. Three to one for the Caps.
McGraw in off the end boards. Clark plays it, leaves it for Brent. The Sims. Sims gave it away. McGurk with a shot off the end boards. Clark plays it to the boards. Just over four minutes left to play. Another chance for St. John's. Penalty coming up now to the Red Wings. This they did not need. Already down by two. And St. John's with a very good power play. Okay, against Steven Sims, the captain. Four twelve to go, first period. Bishop. Just announcing the last St. John's goal. Pender down into the corner. They try and work it out in front for Bishop. That was tipped away. Now the race is on. Caps get back. Off the boards. It's going to come out in front of the goal, and Downer has to cover it. Not quite the angle that they were looking for. They meant to go around behind the net. But the boards came out in front, so the face off in the St. John's end right down below us. McGraw leaves it behind the goal. Murphy Johnson. Cross checking is the call. Whoop, they try to leave it back. Pass missed. And Bishop has it. Bishop in over the blue line, makes a move, trying to split the defense. He's in there. Bishop scores. Oh my goodness, what a tremendous individual effort. Joel Bishop, his second of the game, did that all by himself. He took that Aaron pass back inside his own blue line and went end to end. Look at this. Here's Bishop in his own end. Thought about dropping it back. He said, no, I'm going to take this myself. Beats one defenseman, gets around the other one, goes one way, gets Clark going to his right, goes back to his left, and wow. That is the highlight goal of the series so far. And a big lead for St. John's. Crowd has gone kind of quiet here at the Hotter. Michael Hines dumps it in. Pender looking for it. Hines takes him hard to the boards, gets it to the front of the goal, and it's cleared to the board trip below us. Langdon gets it back for Hines. He's pushed against the boards. His centering pass at the back of the net. McKay pinches in, holds it in. Now it's Brandon Hines with it. Back of the point for McKay. McKay winds up, shoots. Knocked down in front. Langdon looking for it. Humber Dredge comes up with it. Humber Dredge calmly clears it out as we are down to two and a half minutes ago. It's Brandon Hines. Look out, he's got a chance to shoot it. But Downer read that all the way. Is about five, six feet out of the blue paint. Cuts down the angle. Smothers that one. Talked about it many times. Brandon Hines is one of the, with one of the best shots in senior hockey here in the province. There was no passing option, so Downer could come well out of the net. Didn't give Hines anything to shoot at. Here's Norman into the middle. McGraw tried to flip it in. It finally does get in deep. Fewer in looking for it. Norman with his shot. That just goes wide. Drover picks it up. Drover. He's knocked off the puck, and it's cleared out again by the Caps. Under two to play here in the first. It's been an eventful one. Another turnover. Draw with a shot. 
And that went up and out of place. He tried to go top shelf. Didn't hit anybody, so I believe faceoff will come outside the blue line. One forty-six left to go. Knight backhands it in behind the Deer Lake goal. Here's Brandon Hines. Coffee just gets it in. That's delayed offside. Deer Lake has to clear the zone. Murphy Johnson will take his time. That's picked off. Coffee just avoids a hit. Lost the puck. Cole clears it out. McKay. Lucas McKay. The Hines. Over to an open wing. Nobody there. There's Hines. His shot. Stopped by Downer. Didn't get a whole lot on that one. McGurk off the boards. Down the ice. Whistle goes. Icing against the Caps. 1-0-1. Left to go in the first. Into the final minute, Pender, McGraw, took that hard pass, knocked it out of the air, gets it to McKim, McKim down in the corner. Players battling for it in along the boards. Finally it comes out, Jordan Marr, Marr's got a little bit of room, Marr shoots, again down, had a little peek, a little peek over the left shoulder, a little peek over the right shoulder, but he had it squeezed between the pads. Drover to face off against Humber Dredge. Stevens off the glass, out. Rolling puck, and I think this is going to get over the goal line as well. Another icing call against the Caps with 20 seconds to go. 20.7 for being specific. Face off win, Mayer shot one off a stick. Goes to the far boards. Thompson able to just tip it out. Lucas Robinson. Oak to Mayer. Mayer turned it over as he got in over the blue line, and that'll do it. A great opening period for the visiting team. St. John's Roof Tech Caps leading this one four to one after the first 20 minutes of play. A couple of goals by Joel Bishop, including a brilliant end-to-end -end rush. We're gonna take a break. 18 minutes on the intermission clock. We come back for the second period. Deer Lake needs to dig themselves out of a big hole. They already trailed this series two games to none, and now find themselves down by three goals at the end of the first period. All right, we'll take a break. We'll be back with period number two in just a few minutes. You're watching game number three of the 2024 Herder Memorial Championship Series from the Hunter Memorial Recreation Complex in Deer Lake, exclusively on AO.Live.
All right, they finished their chuck-a-puck competition with the fundraiser, and we are underway here in the second period. St. John's leading this one four to one after the opening period. They're in looking for more early. Stevens down in the corner, he lost it. Langdon battling along the boards. Humber Dredge has got it. Shot went off a stick wide. Stevens up along the blue line. Tried to play it in. Taken by Langdon. Long pass up ahead. Here's Brandon Hines with a chance. High shot. Scores. Brandon Hines. St. John's turned it over in their own end. Player fell down at center. Hines was all alone. And we talked about it earlier. You give him enough chances, he's eventually going to bury it. See, there's the turnover right there. Comes to Langdon. The player gets tripped up at the blue line. So two players collided. Hines all alone. Nobody over on that right side. He beats down her, and there's some life in the Red Wings. Four two. Parfrey, long shot in. Clark stops that. Drew Langdon picks up the only assist, made that long pass, looked up and saw Hines all alone out there. Robinson ahead for Marr. Tried to get it over for Normore. Following up on it was Drover gets it to the front of the goal. Over, kept it in, bounces right out in front, back towards the blue line, kept in. Puck goes up in the air, right in front, backhand by Normor is stopped by Downer. Drover behind the goal, back at the point. McKay tried to get a shot through, that came out over the blue line. Deerlake has to clear the zone, almost too many men. Players started to come on, went back in, here's Drover. Drover, cutting out in front. Downer made the save, rebound is there. They crash the net. No goal. Gerlake is celebrating. The referee along the goal line clearly indicated. Well, let's see. You may not get a replay of this because the referee waved it off. They are going to talk about it. Gerlake celebrating. They went to the bench thinking they had made it 4-3. But now we've got a discussion. One of the linesmen coming in, throwing his two cents. Big moment here. Big moment. No goal. Red Wings began celebrating, but the referee right along the goal line immediately waved it off emphatically. And that call stands. That shot kicked away by Downer. Red Wings coming out with some jump here in this second period. McKay couldn't get the puck in deep, brought out by the Caps. That pass off the mark down the ice. And that'll be icing against St. John's. That shot rip wide. Puck goes to the boards. McKim trying to backhand it out. Kept in. Finally cleared out by the Caps. It's McGraw, even with his speed, couldn't catch up to the puck. Another icing call against the Caps.
Red Wings with a wholesale change. Hines won the faceoff. Back to the point. Shot got through. Came in from Oak. Puck bouncing around just outside the blue line. Just through the boards. Michael Cole. He gets hit but gets it ahead to McGurk. His shot hit a leg. Pass up ahead for Michael Hines and just beyond his reach and icing. If he could have corralled that, he had half a step. Again, the Red Wings change up all five players. Brandon Sims on the back end. They get the Drover Murr Normore line up front. Sims behind the net for Brent. Mike Brent lugging it out. Makes the pass that went between the feet of Drover. And again, it'll be icing. Puck goes up along the glass. Normore behind the net for Sims. Sims lost his balance momentarily and then turned it over. Caps are on it. Tried to throw it in front, picked off by Marr. Jordan Marr. Pass. Didn't go anywhere. Will come back to Marr. He'll leave it back behind the net for Sims. They head for. No more to Drover. That didn't work. Caps with a chance. Shot scores! Murphy Johnson. And just some sloppy play by the Red Wings. They turned the puck over two or three times. Couldn't get it out of their own end with a good outlet pass. Eventually, out the stick of Murphy Johnson, and he buries it. So a good start in this period by the Red Wings. Negate it now by that goal. Goes up high. Five to two as we come back live. Caps in again. Off the end boards, came right out in front. That shot knocked down by Thomas. Michael Cole has a Cole with a move. Couldn't get the shot away. Caps maintain possession. Norman back at the point. That shot kicked away by Clark. Parfrey. Then the Knight into the slot. McKay just gets it to the boards. He and McGurk go to the boards. Can't get it out. Here's Knight in the high slot. Turn, shoots. That hit Coffee. Again, they can't get it out. Cole threw it through the crease. Stevens. Down to Knight. Try to get it out in front. McKay's got it. McKay trying to get away from Knight. He stopped. Leaves it back for Urquhart. Up at the blue line, finds Parsons. Tried to go across ice, went off. Caps player right down to the goaltender, Clark, and he's got to cover it up, and they're like looking very unorganized in their own end right now. They had things going their own way the first couple of minutes of this second period. Got one, thought they had another. Since then, all Caps. Humber Dredge makes the pass across. That shot by Heffernan went high. Pender keeps it in behind the goal. Thompson. Thompson holding it, having a look around. Goes back behind the goal to Stevens. Stevens trying to get away from Robinson. Coming in to help out is Hines off the boards. Langdon. Hines knocked down Humber Dredge in the corner. Robinson. Goes the other side. Good pass for Langdon. Langdon blew a tire. Stayed with it, but that's going to be offside. Pass was right on the tape, and 
Langdon just lost his balance. Oak and Heffernan for heavy words. Again, the officials get in quickly before that escalates. Fourteen forty to go, second period, five two lead for the St. John's Caps. Brent dumps it in. Puck is cleared back out down the ice. Not enough for racing. Sims back to get it. Steven Sims up at the blue line. He's looking for Normore. That was broken up. Back comes Bishop. Bishop. Right to feed it in front, picked off by Marr. Marr looking for Drover. That was intercepted. McGraw looking for Murphy Johnson. That was kicked away by Drover, but it's going to be a penalty. High sticking will be the call. Mike Brent down to the penalty box. Power play, St. John's Caps. St. John's control it from the face off, get it in behind the goal. Off the glass and that'll get out. Pender. Big hit over on the other side. Coffey stepped into his man, but the Caps come in. And shot by Bishop goes wide. Red Wings have it, and Red Wings clear it. Downer over to McKim. To play to an open wing. Tough sledding along the boards. Red Wings come up with it. Pender to McGraw. Cole on the other side. Now they gain the zone. McGraw picks it up along the boards. Settle it down. Cole with a shot. Clark made the save. Rebound goes into the corner. Whistle has gone. The faceoff will come outside the blue line. Hand pass. Well, I thought it was a hand pass, but it looks like he's going to bring the faceoff all the way down. It's a penalty. Okay, see a player had his stick broken. Kyle McGurk with the broken stick. Blakely slashing. So four on four right now. Oak with a shot that was way high over the top of the goal. Knight has got it and that is the call. Kyle McGurk two for slashing. One shot up wide, hit the back of the net. Norman to Knight. Brandon Knight. Stops, shoots. Clark just got a piece of it. Brandon Hines to Oak. Oak the other side. Puck goes down into the corner. Knight's got it. He gets hit by Michael Hines. And away come the Caps. Humber Dredge, Humber Dredge, threw it into the crease, cleared away by Clark. Now we'll go the other way. Deer Lake now on the power play. Scores! Back in it. Brandon Hines. 
We'll pick this one up in the Deer Lake end. This is Murr, stops, feeds Hines, little toe drag, pulls it back, snaps it home. So it was 5-2 with St. John's on the power play just a moment ago, thinking if they score on this one, go up 6-2. That could be the series, to be honest. Instead, St. John's pick up a penalty. Dearly got on the power play. They only took a few seconds. And Brandon Hines with his second in a row. Suddenly it's 5-3. No more. Brent. They're saying it was from Normore and Sims, but it was Mara who made the pass. Regardless. Backhanded out. Here is Steven Sims. Normore tried to tip it to himself. Mara's got it. Mara will shoot it in. That line will head off. Ten and a half to go here in the second. Just a two goal game. That'll go out of play, down in the corner. So that face off will come outside the blue line. Thomas against right out. Thomas won the faceoff for Deer Lake. Let's swing it over to McKay. Lucas McKay skates away with it. He'll take it down into the corner. He gets hit. Puck comes loose. There's a the shot. Scores! <laughs> Deer Lake having all kinds of trouble just a few minutes ago. Right back in it. Jonathan Park makes it a one-goal game. McKay drives it down into the corner. See, he gets hit hard, but he did his job, got it down in deep. And then the Red Wings win the board battle, comes back to Park, rips it past Downer. We get ourselves a hockey game, folks. 5-4, just about halfway through this game. Boy, Deerlick looked all but dead three or four minutes ago. Once famously said, reports of my death have been greatly exaggerated. And the crowd comes back to life. McKay gets the assist. There's a shot. Clark made the save. Good job by Oak to clear the rebound. Comes back to Oak. Over to Robinson. Up at the blue line. Down Hines. Goes the other side. It's Michael Hines, he took that pass from Brandon. Right in front it comes, Langdon looking for it. Now it's St. John's forced to clear it. Now this will be icing. Nine twenty-three left, second period. This is a dandy. There's Ed Whalen, the former Calgary Flames announcer and Calgary Stampede wrestling announcer would say we got a ring-a-ding-dong dandy going here. Late, great Ed Whalen. Humber Dredge working along the blue line, tried to leave it back for Pender. He's back to Humber Dredge, trying to get it out in front. He's got it behind the goal. 
Humber Dredge. Turns, gets it down into the corner. Thompson trying to feed it out in front. It's back to Thompson, back at the point. Down to Humber Dredge. Humber Dredge spinning away from Oak. Tried to play it in front, it's cleared away, and here's Park for Anderson. Anderson in over the blue line, his shot goes wide. Park's got it in the corner. Threw it right through the slot, nobody there. Back at the point, the shot was knocked down. And behind everybody was Humber Dredge, couldn't get the pass. Heffernan with a shot, Humber Dredge will pick it up over on the fireboards. He'll come back to Heffernan. He's pushed off the puck, gets it down deep. Sims has it. Up to Anderson, he'll flip it out at center. Heffernan lifts it back in. Wide of the goal, back to pick it up, Big Mike Brent. Brent, long pass. Spotted Drover up at the blue line. Drover got a stick on it, now he's got it behind the goal. Cody Drover, Drover holding it, getting it out in front. Back for Sims. Sims lost it in his skates. Caps get it, clear it out. That's broken up. Marr back to get it. Jordan Marr. Marr with a little bit of room. Marr in over the blue line. A shot off a leg and up and out of play. The faceoff will stay in the St. John's end. 7.44 to go. Dumped in by the Caps. McKay in looking for it. Gets it to Michael Hines. To Brandon, back to Michael. He's got Langdon with him as he comes in over the blue line. Brandon catching up, Brandon Hines with a shot. Kicked away, the rebound was there. Coffee couldn't get a stick on it. That will go the other way, two on one down low. Shot, oh what a save made by Clark. That's his best of the game. Clark, the left-handed goaltender, stuck out the right hand. The Caps stay on it. Bishop trying to get it out in front. Clark's got it, dives on it, and holds on to it. What a big save by Billy Clark to keep this a one-goal game with just under seven minutes to go in the second. Face off here, the Deer Lake end. Red Wings win it. Oh, gets it over to Robinson. Robinson gets it to center. Stop there. McGraw back in his own end, drops it back to his defenseman. Long pass up for McKim. That was intercepted by Marr. Marr's got it. Here's Jordan Marr. To Drover. Drover in over the blue line. Shot just wide. Downer dives out. The puck is loose in the crease. It was available there. Red Wings stay on it. Marr turning in the corner. Behind the goal, puck bounced up. Drover caught it, put it down. Trying to protect it. No more with it. Back for Drover. Drover's tripped up. Crowd wants a penalty. No call. Marr battling along the boards. Drover. Down for Normore. Tried to give it back to Drover. The give and go comes back to the point. Caps come up with it. They'll head the other way. Come this side. Back the other side. That was blocked by Robinson. Thomas got it down to Park. Back to Thomas. Thomas. His shot went wide. Kept in by Robinson. Thomas in behind the goal. Couldn't handle it. The Caps. No icing as they shoot it right on to Clark. Got to drop it. He does. Sims up at the blue line. Finds Thomas. Thomas gains the blue line himself, then drops it off. Will come this side. Anderson's shot was blocked. Just over five to play here in period two. And what a period this has been. 
Sims hit his man. Humber Dredge in front, shoot, scores! Right out. Sims tried to hit his man along the boards, but couldn't stop him. Back to a two goal game. Here it is, Sims. Lucky he didn't get called for interference, but the player kept going as Humber Dredge fed it across. Six four. Got a wild one going here at the Hotter. It's cleared out. McKay. Lucas McKay. Just got it in over the blue line and it's cleared out. Caps are on it. Here they come again. Knight. Good poke check by Coffee. That's Michael Hines. Can't get away. Mark right out with the finish and that pass from Humber Dredge. The sixth goal for the Caps. That shot caught by Clark and held on. Just over four minutes to go now. Back to a two goal game. With all the goals being scored, no lead is safe apparently. goes to the boards for the faceoff. Back to the blue line, kept in by the Caps. They'll throw it in deep. Oak back to pick it up behind his goal. Trying to get it to Drover. Meyer has got it. Jordan Meyer turning. Meyer heading up the ice. He'll flip it in. Norman, there first for the Caps. Stops in the corner. He'll get rid of it out at center. Down right to Clark. So no icing. He'll give it to Oak. There's a giveaway right in front, a chance here for the Caps, and getting back to break that up was Robinson. Made up for the error. And Billy Clark in goal for Deer Lake. Seemed to be shaken up on that play. He is bent over in the crease. Staying in, but he does not look 100%. That pass into the skates of Fewer. Normore gets it in deep for the Red Wings, under three to play. Off the glass, out, down the ice. Wasn't touched by anybody, so the faceoff will come back in the St. John's end down to our left. As I rewind my brain, which I'm apt to do from time to time, I think I called the premier, Paul Fury. It's of course, Andrew Fury did the ceremonial opening face-off. For some reason, that just popped in my head that I, that I did that. My apologies to the premier. That's thrown into the crease, and the Caps come up with it. Knight, just onside, gets it to McGurk. McGurk with a weak shot, stopped by Clark, and Clark will hold it. Get the go Deer Lake go chant going here at the Hotter. Anderson knocks it down, takes it to the boards, avoids a hit, 
Gets it down in deep. Bishop back to get it first for the Caps. Spins away from Anderson. Good outlet pass. Right to McGraw. McGraw will dump it in. He'll go into chase. Sims gets there first. McGraw got a stick on it. Tried to get it out in front. Bishop back at the point. Back towards the point. Picked off by Park. And Park just gets rid of it. He wants to get a change in. He heads to the bench. Dearly gets new players out there. That's picked off, cleared out. Bishop, Coffey watching him. Bishop scored that great goal earlier. Up ahead, Humber Dredge. Marr to an open wing. Drover will get there first. Drover in over the blue line. Drover with a shot, down with the save. Rebound is there. Marr's got it on his stick. Marr with a shot. Downer stopped that, and this time Downer covers the rebound. Just outside a minute to go in this period. And we mentioned earlier, Billy Clark was shaken up on a play about a minute and a half, two minutes ago, and he is leaving the game. Joshua Roach, the Red Wings picked up from the Stephenville Lightning as their backup goaltender for this series has taken over. He was the starter in game number two. He comes in with a minute 10 to go in this period. There's Joshua Roach, face off down the other end. Marr back at the point. McKay shot towards the goal. Blocker save made by Downer. Back at the point. Coffey kept it in. Marr's got it. Marr turning. Stops down in the corner. Back to McKay. McKay, big slap shot. Went off a leg out in front. I think that was blocked by Stevens. And ended up in the corner. And then cleared down the ice by the Caps. Coffee. To McKay. That goes up into the stands and behind the play, Thomas is shaken up down at the blue line. Or oh, sorry, that's Normore, 92. Didn't see what happened. I was watching the puck go over the glass into the crowd down to our left here. 35 seconds to go in the second period. Teams combined for five goals in the first, five goals in the second. Caps led it 4-1 after the opening 20 minutes. Robinson. That pass was intercepted, dumped back in. Robinson's got it again. Just 15 seconds to go in the period. Robinson, that pass intercepted. Michael Hines, backhanded in. Murphy Johnson around the boards. Out it comes, down the ice. That's gonna do it. Everybody take a breath. What a period that was. Three goals by the Red Wings, two by the Caps. And the lead is two, 6-4 after 40 minutes. We don't get the shots on goal here at the Hodder, so. Okay, they just announced it though. <laughs> right on cue, 47-24, Caps out shooting the Red Wings. 18 minute break, then we'll be back with the third period. You don't wanna miss it, who knows what could happen after that wild second period. You're watching the 2024 Herb Memorial Championship Series, game three from the Hodder Memorial Recreation Complex in Deer Lake here on AO.Live. Stay with us, folks.
right, let's see what the third period brings. St. John's, Roof Tech Caps leading this game six to four after two periods. No shortage of offense in this one. Five goals in the first, 4-1 for St. John's. Five goals in the second, 3-2 for Deer Lake. And that leaves us six to four after 40 minutes. Josh Roach staying in goal for Deer Lake to start this third period. Billy Clark left, starting goaltender, with just over a minute to go in the second. He's replaced by Roach. He was shaken up on a play late in the period. Kyle Downer still in goal for St. John's, of course. All right, we're underway here in the third period. And St. John's in the white with black and red. The red Wings, predominantly red with some white trim. Humber Dredge for St. John's clears it in. Hines tried to chip it out. It's kept in by the Caps. And in behind the Deer Lake goal. Up along the boards, Brandon Hines has it. He'll skate it out. That picked off by Walsh, turned the shot back in. Murphy Johnson turned it over. Brandon Hines goes the other side, looking for Michael Hines. Back at the point, shot, that just goes wide. Back at the point will be kept in by Robinson. Cleared away, Stevens has it, Stevens will get it out to center. Robinson. Humber Dredge kicked it ahead, then tried to bat it out of the air. Hines has got it, he fell down. Cleared out by McKim. Brandon Hines again in over the blue line. The pass was intended for Brandon Hines, but he was turning and heading initially. It looked like to the bench, but he stays in play. Now he'll go to the bench. That line goes off. And here comes McKim. McKim in for checking. Gets there first. McKim in the corner, threw it out of front, back at the point, kept in by Norman. He'll backhand it down deep again. Bishop in there looking for it. Bishop had a couple of goals in the first period. Shot by McGraw goes wide. Back at the point, kept in by Parfrey. He puts it wide. McKim. Back to Parfrey. His shot, that's stopped by Roach. Roach smothers it. Hangs on. Both teams change. And fans still having a good time here, despite the fact their team is down by two right now. Good pad save made there by Roach. All the goals being scored here tonight, you know, a two-goal lead is not, necess not necessarily a safe one. That pass was intended for McKay, went right to Roach, the goaltender. He had to clear it away. Thomas gets it in over the blue line. Watched by Norman behind the goal. Anderson takes it into the corner, then he lost it. Norman trying to get it out. And out it comes. Anderson back at center. Gives it to McKay. McKay getting a little bit of room. He likes to pass it to Park. Park tried to feed it in front. Another chance. Downer's got that, and Downer will hold on. Quick change for the Red Wings. We come right back with the Heinz Heinz Langdon line. Michael Heinz face off against Tanner Humber Dredge. Heinz won the face off. Roger Pender backhands it to the other side. Fewer can't get it out. Kept in by the wings. 
Right out. Up to the blue line and it's turned over just inside the blue line. Michael Hines with a shot over the top of the goal. Dangerous pass that time by the Caps. Right out gets to center, shoots it in off the end boards. McKay back to pick it up. Gets it to Brandon Hines, over to Langdon. Langdon, back for Brandon Hines. Puck knocked off his stick, right out's got it. Makes the safe play, off the glass and out. Brandon Hines winds up, hard shot. Just missed far side, kept in by Langdon. His shot went wide. Wings were changing, so there's nobody back at the point. Brent passed it back to Steven Sims. A turnover this time by the Red Wings. Out they come. Marr. Looking for Drover. Bishop got back, picked that off. Drover's got it back to Marr. Normal with a shot, scores! The shot hit the defense, changed direction, and beat the goaltender like a knuckleball. Mitchell Alexander Normore makes it a one goal game once again. Marr gives it to Normore, and the shot hit the stick of the defenseman, changed direction, went over the glove of Downer. Six five, dumped in by the Caps. Roach plays it around the boards. Knight able to hold it in to McGurk. McGurk over to an open corner, back there to get it is Park. A little trouble with it, finally gets it out. Kept in by the wings, Park, he lost it. McGurk just gets it out to center. Just announced that's Normore's fifth goal of the playoffs. What a great pickup. I remember watching him play with Stephenville this past season, and he was so impressive. I know myself and Robert Golding, who did the games in Grand Falls, Windsor, all season long, said well, whoever goes to the herder needs to pick up Normore. Here's Thomas. Shot scores! Brandon Hines, Patrick, and we're tied. Caps had a chance to clear it, they didn't over to Hines and Boyd. We've talked about his shot so many, many times. That was the perfect example of it. <laughs> he does the leap into the bench, and the hats come out. It's gonna take a minute to clean the ice. 6-6. Six, six. Two goals in the first four minutes, 54 seconds of the third period by the Red Wings. goes into the Deer Lake bench. Boy, they needed him to get going. Just had one goal in the two games in CBS last weekend. Anderson and Thomas get the assists on the Heinz goal. Humber Dredge. In there for checking. Good play by Oak to get the puck out for the Red Wings. This is Langdon against Thompson. Hines is back out there again. 
Robinson with a shot. Downer made the save. Clearing attempt hit Stevens in the side of the helmet. Looks to be okay. Went down, jumped back up again. Humber Dredge turned, shot it wide. Langdon's got it. Langdon. Again, the safe play gets it out. Walsh. Red Wings changing. Walsh. He was cut off. Michael Hines plays it back for Langdon. A little bit too far for him. Coffee got it to McKay. Pass off the boards. Almost picked off by the Caps. Now they'll bring it in. McGraw looking for Bishop. Just a little bit beyond his reach. Bishop's got a couple in this one. McGraw with a shot. That one off somebody in front. And out of play. Discussion, I think, about where this faceoff is going to take place. Okay, it's going to stay in the Deer Lake end. Last touch by a Deer Lake player. Drover. Couldn't get it out as he was checked. Bishop trying to get it back to the point. He does. That shot again went up and out of play. This time, let's see. Last touch by a St. John's player. They're indicating face off outside the blue line this time. Girk on him. Thomas cleared it away. Sims. Anderson dumps it in. Murphy Johnson around the boards. Good night. He couldn't get a stick on it. Anderson's got it. Sends it back in. Walsh off the boards for Knight. Knight pushed off the puck. Back at the point. Kept in a second time. Now Park has got it here in the near corner. Park back at the point. Thomas with a shot. It was going wide, but Downers got it. Not going to take any chances now. Meyer against McGraw. Drover. Normore. Meyer down in the corner. Normore's got it. Tough to move off the puck. Meyer back at the point. It'll come out. Oak. Shot back in by Robinson. Parfrey. Meyer's on him in a hurry. He gave it away. Back at the point. The chance of shot. Kicked away by Downer and cleared away by McKim. Lucas Robinson goes the other side. Try to get the pass to Marr, couldn't handle that. Norman's got it. Down the ice, anybody touch it? No, they did not, icing. Six, six tie. St. John's appeared to be in control of this one. The end of the first period, up four to one. No quit in this Deer Lake team. Pender. Nice outlet pass. Humber Dredge. He'll skate away with it. Dredge down in the corner. Behind the goal. Pass Mistredge. Kept in by Heffernan. Brandon Hines. Gave it away inside the blue line. 
And came out, brought back in, offside. Thomas bringing it in for Deer Lake, working against Pender. Down into the corner they go, back at the point. Brent shot, knocked down by a stick. Goes to the far side. Anderson looking for it. Kept in by the wings, he'll shoot it in off the end boards. Comes out in front, Pender's got it and he'll turn, take it back behind his goal. Michael Cole. That hit a teammate, he's got it again. That's offside. Ooh. Cole and Sims. A couple of whacks at each other. Those two teammates a few years ago with the Grand Falls Windsor Cataracts. No friends out there now, though. Tanner Humber Dredge to face off against Michael Hines. Robinson. Hines shot. Kicked away by Downer. Going to be a penalty coming up. This is going to go to the Red Wings, I believe, interference. It's going to be Michael Hines. Hines goes to the penalty box. Just under 11 minutes left to go. St. John's Roof Tech Caps go on the power play. They've got the McGraw, Bishop, with McKim. Pender, and the puck is cleared by the Red Wings. Pender comes back to get it. The other player out there is Michael Cole. And this is Cole with the puck. Passed a little bit in behind Bishop. Went over to McGraw, shot by Cole. Went high and wide. McKim back at the point for Pender. Can't shoot it, down in the corner for Cole. Goaltender interference is the call. It's thrown through the crease. McKim is on it. McKim behind the goal out in front. They go the other side. That hit the outside of the net. Bishop hit the empty net. Pender back to Bishop. The other side into the skates. Back to Pender. Again, pass in the skates. Can't one time it. Here's Bishop. Back at the blue line. And for Cole. McGraw. Bishop being kept to the outside right now. Bishop leaves it for McGraw. That shot wide. 45 seconds to go in the power play. Red Wings get it, clear it down the ice. Roger Pender. 30 seconds in the penalty. And drop it back for Bishop. Coffee working against Bishop along the boards. Puck squirts loose. Walsh out there now for St. John's. He's pushed to the boards. Bishop back at the point. Humber Johnson over for. <laughs> down for Humber Dredge. That was yeah. Murphy Johnson to Humber Dredge offside.
Just six seconds left in the penalty to Michael Hines for goaltender interference. Number dredge against Langdon. They'll redo the faceoff. One second went off the clock. McGurk noticed that, and the referee's going to go over, and I assume they're going to put the one second back on, or they'll hold it for one second, however they want to do it. They put the six seconds up on the clock. And redo the faceoff. Backhand through the crease by Knight. Power play is over. Good kill by the Red Wings. Puck comes down to Downer. He will hold it there. Face off against Michael Hines. Again, right to Downer. So they'll do that face off again. Hopped over the stick of Walsh. Fewer, fewer hit to the boards by Langdon. Walsh trying to chip it out. Couldn't get it past the two players there, then finally gets it out. Here's McKay. Shoots it right back in for the Red Wings. Murphy Johnson. Good outlet pass, right on the tape to Michael Cole. Cole brings it in over the blue line. Cole, little drag, threw it in front, cleared away. Came out, brought back in. Mike Brent back to pick it up. Leaves it behind the goal for Sims. Sims up for Anderson. Anderson was checked by Humber Dredge, took it away. Thompson shoots it in. Stevens in there looking for it for the Caps. Humber Dredge continues to work. He gets knocked down. Thompson back at the point. Shot doesn't get through, hit somebody just inside the blue line, comes all the way back to the St. John's blue line. Pender, that pass not handled cleanly by Stevens. McGraw, Pender. Up at the blue line was looking for McKim, was touched, no icing. Anderson, cross ice. Brought in by Marr, Jordan Marr. Rover's shot just missed from a sharp angle. Robinson trying to hold it in. Puck bouncing around. Bishop got a stick on it and cleared it out. Mara back to pick it up. Jordan Mara. To Normore, he tried to tip it ahead for Drover. Now Drover's got it and brings it in. Mara, shot, rebound. It hit the outside of the net. What a chance for Normore. Normore's got it again. Backhand stopped by Downer. Puck still in the crease and Downer's got it and covers it. Cody Drover just missed. Down to 642. 
the Hines line back out there now. <coughs> Excuse me, for the Red Wings. Caps win the faceoff up to McGurk. Kyle McGurk, center, shoots it off the end boards. Came out in front, shot. Oh, what a save. Rebound, put wide, it was an empty net. That was a design play by Kyle McGurk. Seen him do that a number of times over the years where he just shoots it off the end boards. It came right out in front to Brandon Knight. He got a shot away, it was stopped by Roach. I'm not sure who that was coming down on the right side. That had the backhand and looked like an empty net and put it wide. McKim along the boards, down in the corner. Cole looking for it. It's poked free. Langdon's got it. Michael Hines was stopped as he tried to skate away with it. Knight down in the corner. Threw it in front. Nobody there for St. John's. And here's Brandon Hines. Brandon Hines stepping in. Shot. That hit right out. Puck came to Langdon. He's got it. And behind the goal, Brandon Hines. Backhand and downer. Had to hug the post. And it looked like there was a little bit of room. And Michael Hines gets dumped in the crease. And they continue to jaw at each other. Langdon came in, Heffernan there for the Caps. Under six to play here in the third period. Get ourselves a tie game. Scramble draw on the face off. Norman gets to it for St. John's. Norman to a ride out in his skates. Norman hustles up to keep it on side. Caps are on it, good for checking. Goes behind the net though, McKay has got it. The Red Wings will bring it out. McKay, Langdon, cleared out. Right out. He's got Jewer, or sorry, Fewer with him. Right out, shot, bounces around. Again an empty net, they couldn't put it home. What a chance for Pender the third time in this period it looked like St. John's Caps had an empty net over that far post and put it wide. Humber Dredge turning. Humber Dredge stays with it. That one off a skate to the boards. McKay trying to backhand it out. Anderson's got it. Anderson in over the blue line. Anderson with a nice move. Anderson shoots. Looking far side. Just missed. Shot back in. St. John's had to really hustle that time, almost too many men, player jumping over the boards over at the bench. Now they'll settle it down. Four and a half to play. Walsh. Walsh taking it to the outside against Sims. That went through the crease. That shot again through the crease. Back and forth it goes. And finally, it'll come out over the blue line. McGraw turns, shoots it in. That's caught. Dropped by Roach, he'll leave it for Sims. Steven Sims. Got it ahead. Normore on the backhand. That just missed. Bishop picks it up here in the near boards, heads down the ice. Bishop pulls it back. There's that toe dragon that goes wide as he lost it. Bishop looking for it again, has it taken away. Here's Drover. No more shot, save, rebound is there. Caps have it. Cole for Bishop. That pass in the skates of night. He'll turn, shoot it in. And this time Roach is going to hang on to it. There's Michael Cole right there. 3.22 left to go.
Puck in behind the Deer Lake net. Langdon gave it away behind the goal and Roach able to keep it out. Langdon wanted to play it back to his defenseman, but a St. John's player was there behind the goal, got it out in front. Cole gets waved out. McGurk will come in to take it. Brandon Hines into the middle. Michael Hines. Shot can't get through. Langdon's got it circling the goal. Back at the point. Robinson. Down in the corner. Player is knocked down. Net is knocked off. That's Michael Hines again. It's the second time in the last couple of minutes he's found himself on his back in the St. John's crease. This time the net came off. Under three to play. Michael Cole against Michael Hutton's. <laughs> Cole wins the faceoff, gets it to Murphy Johnson. He'll skate it at himself. Johnson dumps it down into the corner. Keeps on going, hit Oak. Oak got the puck into the corner. We go the other side on it is Langdon. Langdon, his pass for Hines a little bit too far. Murphy Johnson. To Stevens. Stevens is stopped. Shot in right on goal. Blocker save made by Downer. Now the puck goes into the corner. It's going to be a penalty coming up to the Caps. High sticking. Thomas is checking to see if he was cut. Looks like it's just going to be the two. Big penalty against St. John's. Comes with just 2.19 to go in regulation time. Power play opportunity for the Red Wings. McGurk gets the puck down the ice for St. John's. Sims. Drover. Back to Marr. Now Hines into the middle. Finds Drover. Drover trying to get the shot away. McGurk tied his stick up on a great play. McGurk and Cole head off for the Caps. Minute 25 to go in the power play. Minute 43 to go in regulation time. Drover around the boards here to the near side. Getting to it first was Bishop sends it down the ice. Got one minute to go in the power play. So far it's been a great kill for St. John's. Langdon looking for it, gets it to Marr. Marr down in the corner. Langdon holding it, gives it back to Marr. Marr turning down for Langdon. Normore's out in front. Langdon, Hines with a shot. That one off of Murphy Johnson and he is shaken up. That cut him in the ankle. He's having trouble getting back up. 35 seconds to go. He's up but he's heading to the bench and here come the Red Wings. Johnson stays out there. Now he goes to the bench. Marr has got it. 45 seconds to go in the period. Pender, he'll get a chance to clear it and he will do so. (laughs) 
weak dump in, cleared out. That's pretty much going to do it for the power play. 25 seconds to go in the period. That power play is now over. Nearly nothing for the Red Wings with the man advantage that time. 10 seconds to go. Barring something crazy in the last few seconds. And folks, for the first time in this herder, we are headed for overtime. And here's the way the overtime works. It'll be a full 18 minute intermission. Then we'll come back. We'll play five on five, sudden death, 20 minute period until somebody scores. Wow, this has been one heck of a game. St. John's trying to take a three game lead in this series for Deer Lake. They want to get within one if they can win this one. We we'll guarantee a game five on Sunday. Big overtime coming up. Again, 18 minute break. Then we'll be back with sudden death. Stay with us here on AO.Live.
All right, three periods, not enough to settle this one. We are headed to overtime. Teams are back out on the ice. There's your Kyle Downer. Team goal for St. John's. All right, sudden death, or sudden victory if you prefer. Next goal wins this one. Five aside to start the overtime. We are underway, Sims controls it. Over to Mike Brent. Brent gets the center, shoots it in right on goal. Never a bad idea in overtime. Hey, shot on goal is a good one. Sims bouncing puck, didn't get through to the goal. Pender's got it behind his net, and Roger Pender. It's the pass up at the blue line. Norman couldn't get a shot away. Off the boards, look out, Brandon Hines, Hines, shoots, missed. Tried to go against the green, put it wide. He's got three in this game. Boy, what an opportunity in overtime. For Brandon Hines, that shot off a stick wide. Kept in, Pender will hold it. Nets knocked off. Players knocked down, whistle goes. Brandon Hines will not get a better chance, I wouldn't think, than what he just had. Almost ended it in the first minute. Once Humber Dredge was knocked down in the crease. He'll head off. Face off comes out. Cody Drover's on it all alone on the rush. Drover in over the blue line, pulls it back, shot off the glove of Downer. No more overstated it. Well, the Caps bring it out. McKim, McKim trying to get it in front of the goal. Wraparound attempt. It's back to McKim. He's pushed to the boards. Robinson's got it, clears it out. Rolling puck, and that'll get over the goal line. Thought it would have been icing, they wave it off. This one, however, is icing against St. John's. Michael Hines threw it through the crease. Langdon couldn't get a stick on it. It's kept in. Roger Pender behind his goal. Couple of early chances for the Red Wings in this one. Shot in, off the end board. Gotta be careful. Ooh, little bit of miscommunication. Roach thought the defenseman was gonna take it. Defenseman thought Roach was gonna cover it and McGurk snuck in there. He got himself a good scoring chance.
McGraw against Drover. Comes to the boards. McKim behind the net looking for Bishop. Went between his skates. Pender able to keep it in. Here's Bishop. Joel Bishop turning. Tried to feed it in front. Mike Brent's got it. Brent off the boards. No more got it out. Caps have it. Pender. Off the glass and in deep. Over to pick it up. Mike Brent. To Sims. For Drover. Drover trying to catch up to the bouncing puck. It's cleared by the Caps. Sims. Over to Brent. Walmart tried to chip it in, didn't get it deep. Parfrey off the boards, down the ice, and once again, St. John's guilty of icing. We've played two minutes, 34 seconds of the first overtime period. Hines gets it towards the goal, they poke away at it, Downers got it, and he'll keep it out. Poor defensive coverage on that faceoff. Michael Hines was able to poke it past and then get it right on goal. He'll go up against Michael Cole again. Caps come away with it this time. Knight. Shot it in, hit the referee. Oak around the boards, Oak winding up. Stopped by McGurk, puck comes back to Hines. He turned it over. Back come the Caps, McGurk, McGurk with a shot. Roach has got it. Teams definitely not sitting back at this overtime. We've had multiple good scoring chances. Two number one lines out there now. McGraw's line against the Drover line. They face off against each other. Drover wins it. Sims has got it. Out it comes. Murphy Johnson, the other side. McGraw, he'll dump it in. Brent back to get it. Brent around the glass. Drover couldn't get it out. Murphy Johnson, his pass went off a skate, one out. Norman, watched by Marr, to Brent, Mike Brent, to Drover, Cody Drover. Brent is in front of the net. Drover couldn't get free. Back come the Caps, Norman up ahead to McGraw. McGraw working against Brent, gets it to the front of the goal, it bounces around. Goes to the far corner, Normore, he'll come this side. Sims, he'll get it out. Pender, watched by Anderson. Red Wings change. Long shot, wide of the goal. Thompson knocked it down with a high stick, he touched it. So the faceoff will come outside. Thomas to face off against Humber Dredge. Cleared in, back to get it, McKay. Lucas McKay, he's forced back by Humber Dredge. Gotta be careful here. Don't mess around with it in your own end, but McKay comes away. Pass up for Anderson, dumped in. Anderson goes in to forecheck. Caps come up with the loose puck, off the boards, out. McKay tried to play with his hand, now he's gonna try and recover, it's swept to the middle of the ice. Nobody there for the Caps. Here's Anderson, he'll go the other side for Thomas, he'll leave it for Coffey. Coffey in a blue line, snapshot. That just went wide and up and out of play.
4.53 gone in the overtime. Caps control it off the faceoff. Norman backhanded in high off the glass. It goes all the way over into the other corner. Ocon at first against Cole, the two number eights in there. Robinson gets it out, picking it up. Here's Hines, Brandon Hines. All alone up there looking for help, trying to get it to his brother Michael. A little bit too far for him. Goes in behind the net. Norman's got it along the boards. Caps will lug it out. This is Knight. And they're against Robinson. McGurk in to help out. Cole looking for it. Cole has got it. Cole fed it in front, cleared away by Robinson. Not out, kept in. Shot, went off a leg. I think that was Robinson blocked that. Knight tried to throw it in front. Robinson blocked that. Back in behind the goal. Cole. Cole having a look around. He lost it, taken away by Oak. Oak up at the blue line, gets it to Hines. Back to Michael Hines. They don't get it out. Kept in by Bishop. Over the other side, that's broken up by Oak. It's a two-on-one, and Oak broke it up. Now the puck goes up over the glass, out of play. Red Wings guilty of messing around with the puck a little bit in their own end, and that time turned it over just inside their own blue line. Now Meyer in to take the faceoff against McGraw. McKim gets it into the Red Wings end. Sims over to Brent. Looking for Norman, or Nor Moore rather. Picked up by Heffernan. Heffernan gets knocked down. St. John's wanted a penalty call. The players are all tied up inside the blue line. Meyer and Heffernan. Now Meyer gets out. Play is allowed to continue. And finally, and now a Red Wing player, Normore gets knocked down. That was a strange sequence. Grant having words with Heffernan. Myron and Heffernan were all wrapped around each other just inside the blue line. Myron couldn't get his stick free, so he dropped his stick so he could get back on side. Even the players weren't sure what was going on. Everything seemed to sort of stop. And the dust settles, the face off will be outside the blue line. Meyer won the faceoff, gets it back to Brent. Mike Brent steps in. Brent is looking for a drover. Went off a stick to the boards. Caps have it. It'll come out. Here's Bishop. Look out. Bishop with a shot. He hit the crossbar. Joel Bishop looking for his third goal of the game. Found the iron in behind Roach. And it came straight back out. Over in for no more. He gets hit, and the puck goes out of play. Face off deep in Caps territory. Hines wins the face off. Brandon Hines couldn't get the shot away. Coffee can't get it in deep. Norman, it's tipped in. Coffee gets there first. Humber Dredge gets upended, and he's going to head to the bench. Here comes Langdon. Stumbled a little bit, kept going, dumped it in deep. Pender off the boards. 
McKay able to keep it in. That shot, bouncing puck goes up and well out of play. in the corner along the boards. Anderson threw it over to the far corner. On it first, McGurk. McGurk gave it away. Came out in front, tipped behind the net by Pender. Big collision along the boards. Anderson stepped into his man, cleared down the ice. And again, it'll be icing against St. John's. St. John's able to get it out from the faceoff. Pass was in behind McGraw. Drover. Pass for Normal. Went under his stick. Shot back in. That's going to be icing again against the Caps. Playing with fire a little bit here in overtime. Again, the Hines line stays out there for the Red Wings. Brandon Hines with a shot. What a save by Downers. He just got the blocker on it. Enough to keep it out. Clean faceoff win for Michael Hines to Brandon. And he got a lot on that one. Murphy Johnson. McGurk. To center. Shoots it in. Racing in there is Knight. Langdon's got it. Plays it to the other corner. Norman turns, shoots it in wide. Knight, that hit the outside of the net. Taken away, Langdon, he'll go the other side. Michael Hines in over the blue line, shot, caught, and then held by Downer. Dropped it for just a second, but was able to cover it. To say this is the best game of the series so far would be a tremendous understatement. I'm going to redo that face off. This one has had a bit of everything. Lots of goals, lots of physicality. Park comes out, Anderson comes in to take the face off against Humber Dredge. Puck slides into Downer, he'll cover it there. Roger Pender behind his own net. Bobbled it. Anderson's on him in a hurry. Park threw it out in front. Goes back to the point. Here's McKay. McKay with his shot. That hit Heffernan. And the Caps bring it out. Dumped in. Heffernan into forecheck. He gets there. Plays it back to the point. Murphy Johnson couldn't pull the trigger. Throws it behind the net. Robinson, Anderson, can't get it out. Kept in, here's Fewer. Fewer holding it behind the net. 
comes in front, Anderson's got it. Anderson heads the other way. Two center, shoots it in. That group will go to the bench. Wholesale change for the Red Wings. All five players. Bishop gets a stick on it. Oak knocked it down. Robinson, he'll go the other side. Kept in. Behind the goal. Rideout was looking for it. Tipped away from him. Race to the board. Strober can't get to it. Norman able to keep it in. Here's Robinson. Lucas Robinson to Drover. Drover into Marr. He was poke checked. Puck goes into the corner. McKim on it. Can't get it out. Drover and behind the net. Walsh fires it around the boards. Robinson rolling puck. He'll get to it. No icing. Jordan Marr can't get away from McKim. He stopped at center. No more. Bishop almost stole it. No more's got it again. Got to be careful again. Good pass up ahead. He'll go the other side for Marr. He'll go to the bench. That line gets off. Bishop. Bishop stepping in. Bishop can't shoot it. Then he scores! Joel Bishop with the hat trick. Couldn't get the shot away the first time. Stayed with it and then put it home. St. John's in dramatic fashion have taken a three to nothing lead in this series. And now there's a bit of a scuffle going on out there. Langdon gave Bishop a bit of a shoulder as he skated by and that's what caused all this. All the players are out on the ice because the game is over. So the officials need to make sure everybody gets separated. What a game we just saw folks. I know the hometown crowd is disappointed. They had some wonderful opportunities in overtime, but Joel Bishop, the hero for the St. John's Roof Tech Caps. Referees are telling the players, get off the ice. And again, where they both exit down in that same area. All right, let's have a look at that winning goal. This is Bishop. You see all the players from Beerley converge on right here. Looked like he was stopped. The puck stays with him, goes wide, beats Roach. And the St. John's Caps have a stranglehold on this Herder series. Now leading it three to nothing. Goal comes with 8.27 left to go in the first overtime. Bishop almost ended it earlier. He rang one off the goal post. Yes, good old fashioned stick to itiveness for Joel Bishop. They're saying second. Thought it was his third. That yeah, was his third. He had two in the first. One that nice toe drag in the slot. The other one the end to end rush. And then ended it there. So that was his third. We're still announcing second. But anyway, doesn't matter. So folks, we'll be back here again tomorrow night. Same bat time, same bat channel. Here on AO.live, 730 tomorrow night from the hotter uh, disappointed. Deer Lake Red Wings crowd. My cameraman, Mike Golding from Deer Lake. He's not going to be here tomorrow night. We've got somebody else doing the camera. Just looked at me and said, I'll see you Sunday. So he's keeping the faith. As the crowd files out, as I say, disappointed, but uh, they saw a heck of a game here tonight. I hope you enjoyed our coverage of the game this evening. That's going to do it for us as the crowd files out. We'll say good night. My name is George Scott. Our cameraman was Mike Golding. 
Hopefully you can come back and join us tomorrow night. Maybe we'll get something like that again. That was a great game. Anyway, folks, good night, everybody. Have a good one.